She's the quick-witted comic that audiences have fell in love with. I am not a prostitute. I'm a comic. Is there a difference? Yes. Prostitutes get paid more. Hilarious. You should go into comedy. I did. She's the marvelous Mrs. Maisel, and along with her Emmy Award-winning cast, is back for season three. I have a really hard task of trying to sum up season three in about 20 seconds, so I am going to ask you guys to do that for me, if that is okay. Susie and Midge go on the road. Yep. Abe and Rose, you know, they kind of hit a bit of a, a bumpy patch. Uh, Abe, you know, leaving his jobs, both jobs. So in season three, we start to see how they they both uh, have to reinvent their lives. At the end of last season, Joel said he wanted to open a club, and and that's his trajectory. And uh, 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 Sophie wants to uh, leave uh, Sophie from Queens behind. I have a Abe. passionate affair with Shy and Abe. Yeah. <laughs> and Sterling. Susie really gets around this season. I thank everybody on tour. It becomes a problem. I should say I've seen five episodes, and none of that happened. Come though. on. I can tell you what does happen. Midge takes her act on the road. From here, we go to L.A., Chicago, Miami. Sterling K. Brown joins the cast. Is your girl going to get good? Susie and Midge meet a host of new characters, and their bond on camera and off remains the heart of the show. You'll always be my number one. But you guys have coined a new term, womance. We feel like this womance is at the center of the show. It's the, the it's central really relationship. It's really wonderful. Wee wee wonderful. Marvelous. Marvelous. A marvelous romance. Mm. Let me ask you this about one another. What is something about the person sitting next to you that you think would make for a great comedy bit? Your life is good. You moved to Barcelona, met a, a gang of weirds, and and started a comedy show. I live a pretty glamorous life. You too. Yeah, you too. I get all my glamour tips from Alex. Absolutely. So what is one way the person sitting next to you is similar to their character? Alex cusses a lot. Ambitious, oh. actually cares about the people around her, genuinely wants to do good, genuinely wants to do good by everyone. Alex is just as smart as Susie and keeps a small circle that are incredibly important. To her. In the spirit of the marvelous Mrs. Maisel, could I ask as many questions as fast as I possibly can speak them? Yes. Okay, who is most like their character? Uh, Alex. <laughs> a, a little bit Alex, yeah. Do you talk fast in real life? Probably at this point, yes. I do, yes. Weirdest business ask you've ever heard of? Oh, I got asked to take off my pants at <laughs> an audition once. Dream guest stars for season four and on. William and Kate. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if they're funny. Right. I wouldn't mind Meryl Streep. <laughs> that works for me. Oh, he's a great I think answer. Rose could have a little moment with Meryl. Oh, God, that's impossible. Ali Wong. I'd love to ha have my wife come on. She, oh, she yeah, be, I'd want Tony's wife. Would. That's my one, too. Our dream is to have Brooke Adams. Mm -hmm. TV doesn't get more marvelous than this. Season three is streaming now. That's why the lady is a child.